Hello everyone, it's Peter One I'm here and welcome to my channel. So I came across a Facebook post which um, described the gratification of someone having received uh, someone paid for their purchases at Aldi supermarket and I thought my first reaction was that was a really nice thing for someone to do but let's have a look at the economy and the um, economic implications of paying for someone else's produce. It is, of course, a random act of kindness. So um, people feel happy. Um, and I think in that situation, people will often tend to buy more when they realise that they've got something for free, uh, which is not necessarily a good thing for the environment and for the ecology. So the idea of money in our society is a very... It's a very hackneyed sort of... Um, and common sort of uh, thing for people to think about. It's an incentive for people to keep on doing things and industrialising and consuming. And this whole cycle of making and, and consuming is a little bit crazy, in my opinion. So often when we hear of these rich magnates like, say, Elon Musk or Jeff Bezos giving a huge donation to somebody, we, all, we automatically go, wow, that's such an amazing thing for someone to do. How generous, how benevolent of that person but it's actually a small part of their fortune and they don't get really affected by making that sort of charity donation so should we should we be hyped up about this sort of thing i don't think we should uh i'm not the sort of person who believes that making money and donating a small part of that is an act of generosity um i'd much rather be someone who spends little earns less um, but is extremely responsible with where, I, where my money goes. And this is the principle of minimalism. A lot of people don't know what minimalism entails and what it really means. Um, I understand that it means uh, a, an ideology where we, are, where we are very, very resourceful in how we um, direct our money, whether it's to ourselves or to somebody else. So it says in the Bible, and I'm not fully in agreement with the Bible, of course, but it says in the Bible that the love of money is the root of all evil. And I think there's a phrase which has been bandied about a lot, and a lot of people don't under people understand why it's important. The love of money. So when you lust for money, and when you're kind of hyperfixated on it, it becomes, it takes up all your attention, and you lose sight of other things like kindness, love, and respect for other people. Uh, this is the case with Jeff Bezos, for example, running Amazon. He has a huge turno turnover of workers uh, because no one is satisfied working there except for the executives. So he doesn't provide value to other people. and At the same time, he's very, very rich. And unfortunately, the love of money is something that politicians espouse as well because politicians and governments are always talking about budgets and spending and uh, how much debt they're in. And I think that's a very, very bad mindset to put yourself into. We need less talking about money, in my opinion. I believe it's very important to be giving value to other people, but not in the form of money. Value comes in many, many, many different types. And providing value can be in the form of education, it can be in the form of friendships and relationships, or it can be in donations like clothing, food, um, talk about vegan food, of course and other things like that, which are forms of generosity in themselves, but are not money. And I think we should, we should avoid the concept of um, giving money to people. Money is a convenient way of being generous. It's too convenient, in my opinion. And um, if we really know people, and we know what they want and what they need, we can give them things other than money, such as I mentioned. I believe that because money is in, in fact a, a sort of social contract. I know this is not um, normally spoken about with money, um, but I regard it as a social contract because what you're basically doing is making an agreement with someone that the, 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 the value they're giving, that you're giving them is a sort of token for something else. So it's a contract of sorts, and contracts should be regarded with great amount of you know, um, fastidiousness and, and care and and a sense of duty. And that's what, where I think money should be placed in the context of society. So in conclusion, I think that giving people money at random is a very bad thing to do. Um, it's a lazy way of acting in society. And although we may get accolades for 
giving money generously to other people. I don't think it's a very fair and equitable and um, reasonable way of of uh, giving value to other people. That's my opinion for sure. Hope you learned something from this video and I will see you next time with more news. Bye for now.